guys so i wanted to do a valentine's day launch just a really really small one to get us started um one of my 2024 goals was to do more themed launches and events and this is the perfect one for me so i ended up only doing literally like i think it was six items um a very very small launch but uh, i started off by sketching things out with my ipad and getting a couple of ideas down this tote bag i really do want to do i didn't do it in the end um but it is so cute i'll have to do it maybe just as a normal product instead of for valentine's day but yeah so i went through here at the end and sort of marked out the ones that i was really interested in doing so that i knew what to put my focus on when it comes to modeling good morning i have just woken up as you can probably Hell. I just want to go to the post office first thing this morning because it gets really really busy we've only really got one near us um, so I want to get that done whilst there possibly won't be a queue and then we'll get to crafting Okay, this is my first batch that's going to go in. We've got the competition winner dog, these macaroons, which uh, could look better, but that's okay. These will be uh, some otter earrings for my cousin. With a hair there. Okay, here we are. Um, these would be his and hers otter keychains, and then his and hers otter keychains with a little heart. These will be the mismatched heart earrings and then I've got this little um, dried plant holder frog which I'm going to paint. He's also got a little butt. So I'm going to paint him green afterwards as well. So this is a very small batch um, just to start us off, see how it goes. I also don't know if I showed you guys my tiny little oven which is so cute. So there's the little frog painted with the little otter. This is what the heart-shaped otters look like. I also had a go at making little sort of macaron ones which I'll turn into earrings. Um, and then I do like these as a little sort of like mismatch earring set. Um, so I'm going to glaze all that later today. Um, I don't have time now because I start a ceramics course in about an hour, um, which I'm so excited for. I won't really want to make animal mugs. So as I said in my like 2024 business plans. So yeah, we're going to start that. So I didn't actually get any footage of the glazing because it was a very annoying and glazing is very stressful. Um, but I did get some footage of me putting a couple of the pieces together and getting the final products. And honestly, I am so happy with these. These came out so cute, especially these otters. I'm literally in love and want to make more of these for sure. 
so this is the full finished range i made these little macaron earrings this little dried or fake plant holder frog these mismatch heart earrings and of course the iconic otter key rings which are oh, i'm still in love Hi, I just wanted to do a little note. Um, I watch shop launch videos all the time on YouTube for small businesses and the likes, and they push live on their launch and they post to social media and immediately they're getting orders, and like loads of orders and it's going really well. Obviously that's not the reality for a lot of small businesses, uh, especially mine, and that's completely normal. Um, so I just wanted to come on and sort of say, you know, I did post my Valentine's Day um, launch post and the products, now it was yesterday, um, and I didn't get immediate views and immediate orders. Um, I'm very, very lucky I just had an order now for the little frog guy, so he's already gone. So cute which I wasn't expecting. Um, I was expecting maybe not all of this even sells. Um, so that's really positive, but it's completely fine if your first sale isn't for a couple of weeks or even months. I like that's normal, especially at such a small scale. So I just wanted to put a note there to say that, you know, all these launches that you see and all these things that you're comparing yourself to are a small fraction of people compared to the thousands and thousands of people also doing shop launches and Etsy launches that aren't seeing that level of orders and a success on a shop launch. So don't be discouraged when you see those and it doesn't work the same for you. You're still building your brand up, you're still building your products up and you'll eventually get to that point. Um, but please don't feel discouraged at this moment if you're the same as me and you don't get an order immediately as you post the launch and just keep going and have fun.